and it's a question is does workforce availability really limit what is possible we have this 120,000 goal 90,000 new um, in the cap and uh, is that even technically possible um, given the big ramp up that we have now and um, the challenges we're seeing uh, you know is it time to uh, say hey we want to do as much as we can but like we should be realistic here we're not going to get 90,000 when a lot of this federal funding goes away, um, we, we need really need to think about what the impacts are going to be um, of, um, of do nothing versus do something versus do everything. And um, I think I think that going back to you know the funding that we know we have, um, it, it draws a stark picture. And I think that's so. I I do think TJ, back to your point, like, can we get it done? Is it realistic? I, I'm not sure that it is. I mean, I think we still see it as like a, a moonshot, and we're going for it. But you know, we've been honest all, all along the way that we're not sure that it, we can accomplish these goals. Um, and it keeps a lot of people up at night. I think it's the first time I've seen it be this bad across all of the programs. And I wanted to note, um, you know, a. Uh, uh, a couple other things that from our perspective, um, you know, could be feeding into this is there's a broader just um, dearth of folks in the trades, right? And so 